Hello everyone. So we are going to start the fourth lab of module five system hacking. Exploiting the client side vulnerability and establish establishing a VMC session. Right, attacker use mostly the client side vulnerability to exploit the updated softwares, thereby attaining the access of the machine on which the software is installed basically. And VNC, uh, for VNC I'm telling you is enables the attacker to remotely access and control the computer target from another computer, you can say, or mobile device. So whatever they are in the world, at the same time, it is also used by the network admin organization throughout every industry sector for a range of different scenarios and use cases including providing IT desktop support to colleagues and friends and accessing system and services on the move. So here we will show you, you know, how attacker can exploit the vulnerabilities in the target system to establish and authorize VNC session and remotely control of these targets. So we are using here Kali Linux as attacker's machine and the victim machine we will use the base machine we have into it this one right so to start first thing to launch the terminal and obviously for exploit we are going to launch the math exploit framework console msf console Then we'll search some exploits for privilege escalation, right? First, let it start. Let me check this one. So here we go. Then we'll search some exploits uh, for privilege escalation and for that we'll use the command search space MS11 and pressing enter. It's using slow search. Okay it be there we go these are the name of exploit the disclosure date the rank and the description you can see here these all exploits are for privilege escalation so now we are going to use Zero three import this one. And two. This is to this exploit is basically for to import something in the browser to check the option available. In this exploit, we'll type here first to set payload for Windows, and it's all about VNC. Inject.
it was TCP and to so payload is ready then to check all the options we can type here show options is auto VNC exit v, uh, function L host port VNC host and VNC port so for that we will set all these so first we will set L host attackers IP so we can check the IP address of this machine as we had checked and it was uh, let me check again 1.3 right so 192.168.1.3 and then enter we have set the local host then set the local port L port 443 for HTTPS right then next is after that what are the options for that then you can see here we have taken the L host and L port we have given and simply type exploit enter you can see showing the server started the local IP 192.168.1.3 so we can click now we are going to switch on the victim machine and open the browser browser the link we have so can we do will it work I don't think so well it's HTTP link okay so 8080 192 it's not 1.14 so we can give it a 1.3 then the port detail 8080 and go showing not found so we have executed basically so once you have clicked enter <coughs> to show the blank screen then again back to the attacker machine Kali Linux you can see here after execution This is a script right we have executed and here we got the detail of import Mozilla 
as you exploited that browser and we are getting the detail over here as you can see here the user int mozilla 5.0 windows nt in the firefox this receive request for this so once anybody can will search on these things will get the multiple detail over here this is all about the privilege escalation and create a vnc session on the victim machine and we can get the detail on the attacker machine right so this is all about your lab 43 exploiting the client side vulnerability and establishing a VNC session so as I've told you and just summarize again is simply what we have done first we launch the MSF on the attacker machine then we'll search uh, some exploit for privilege escalation then we have taken the exploit which is basically for the browser right to import then we use that exploit and set a payload then we have given the detail of the local host and the port then we go to url then we have executed that particular url in the victim machine after that whatever he is doing you can get the detail on the attacker machine this is all about you have created a vnc session on the victim machine by using the privilege escalation part so this is all about your lab 44 43 i'm sorry we have finished right thank you